Good day guys, Bing here. Um, previously we did this exercise um, uh, 23095. Um, uh, we used the model in place and, um, and we modeled them separately. So it's quite time, very time consuming. Um, so I, so I just, okay, so um, Mr. Bong Da, thank you for your suggestion. So, um, yeah, parts can work in this, um, this one. So, um, today we're going to try, uh, to use parts to create this. Okay. So I'm going to borrow this. I, I'll use this one because, um, I want to, uh, um, use the line of, on um, this roof. So what I'm going to do is, uh, let me think, uh, maybe I'll just copy this. So, uh, if, if you want to download this file, so it's, it's, uh, 2309 form, you can, you can find it there. So, okay. So I'll copy this. Maybe I'll just copy, copy everything here to create it, uh, another one. Uh, okay. So. Now I'm going to select one of the, we only need one roof and then from that, um, roof and we can use, uh, parts. Okay. So let's just edit in place for this one. We're just going to delete any of the void. So let's just delete any of the void. Oh, hang on. So we need the solid part and also we need to change this one from these angles. So, uh, so previously we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight part for this one, we're going to use 360. So it's one roof, one roof. Okay. So, okay. So this is it. So let me just finish this. So now we have one piece. So you can see this is one. If I type HI, so you can see this is one revolve okay so one revolve and we can use this one we can uh use a uh, create parts and to uh split split this um into uh uh different parts right so let's select it click on create parts okay so now what we need to do is type uh, let's just type hr so we can see all these so we so we can use use these edges to create those parts uh, uh where am i select this okay so here so you can see we can use divide divide parts so click on this now we can start to draw lines okay so edit sketch so here we can pick line so i'm going to just click on this top so um now we can start to pick lines so uh uh, this can be a little bit tricky because I can't really tell the color. So maybe I'll change this one to uh, text consistent. Okay, so now that's better. So that's white, gray, uh, a light blue, green, or teal. Um, this one looks like white again, and then dark blue. So now I'll just pick some lines. So for example, this. Oops. Ah. Okay, so some lines. Let's try to maybe uh, stop here. Uh, maybe, uh, yep, yeah, stop here. So I'll just f see what happens if I click on this finish. Okay, so now I've clicked on finish and um, how do I isolate? Maybe I'll just finish this one and just make sure I uh, show parts that's correct. So maybe, um, let, let me try to select, uh, how do I select that one? So maybe this one, the HI, uh, is that right? Now that's parts, but uh, looks like some of the lines not working. Uh, let's just do it again. So go edit, uh, divide parts again, I think. Okay, edit sketch. Uh, looks like uh, okay. So we we are going to create a new one. So maybe cancel this. Cancel this. Okay. So this is because we select this this part. <laughs> um, yeah. 
I'm not very familiar with parts, so let's try. Uh, let me just type uh, HR. Um, yeah, it's a, a bit confusing. So maybe we should just um, move this one away from here. Uh, it won't work. So maybe I'll delete all these. Maybe let's delete some of these. We don't need uh, that many. Okay, so so this one's right. So edit if I yeah. So you can see if I click on edit division, so we can go edit sketch. So these are the previous uh, sketch lines. Um, yes, uh, I'm not really sure. Maybe we should uh, let's just create some more. Okay. So maybe this one, this one, this one, uh, and this one, and this one. Okay, so let's finish and finish. Okay. So I think it works. Okay, so I think it works. So I'm going to select all, filter, and uncheck the roofs. Okay, and then MV. I'll see if I can move. Ah, oh, looks like we can't move the parts because currently we only have those show parts. So uh, maybe we'll show origin, uh, original, and then we trying to select the origin original. Uh, I think this is the one original um, model in place. So I'm going to move this away to here. Okay, and then show maybe maybe show both okay so now you can see all these um i think uh okay so we're missing some lines yeah this is a little bit tricky so anyway so let's just edit division edit sketch uh looks like this one this one doesn't work maybe we should add a uh let's try to add a a arc and see what happens okay so this one this one and let's see what happens so if, if i finish finish okay so yeah so i think it works maybe i'll show, change it to show parts again so we can select so now you can see you can select individual parts for individual parts so let me just ch check the material of this one. Okay, so white. I'll con control C, copy, finish. So go back to here. So this one and uh, this part, this one. Ah, uh, what's ah? Uh, looks like this one's not. It's not. Um, yeah, nah, not right. This one's okay, but not this one. So yeah, it's weird. Um. Anyway, uh, let's just apply some so for example this one's white this one's white i'll select one two and this one's okay and then here so for parts you first need to uncheck this box uh material by origin original so uncheck the box so now you can change so i'll just control v white so now you can see uh it will uh match the material so and same this one's uh let me check check the material teal control c finish select this part uh is that right so this one this one this one and then just uncheck the material by original and control v and then that's it so it's very simple so um i think so if i go to 3d let's go to 3d view Oh, so th sorry, this is already 3D view. So let's rotate a little bit. Now you can see it, this is one one element, but uh, we create parts and then we can apply different material to them. So it's I think it's easier than this, but the only issue is whether we can just divide them properly. So can, uh, we, you can see we have some issue here. Um, okay, so what I'm going to do is I'll pause this. Uh, I'll pause this video, and I'll see. 
uh, if if I can uh, create all the parts on this one uh, model uh, model in place. Okay, so wait for me. Okay, I just noticed this when I tried to edit this. So this is why um, this this bit doesn't work. So we just need to. Uh, be very careful. So when we draw these lines, make sure you pick the end point. Um, okay, so if this is the case, it will be, I think it will be quite easy. We just need to, um, we just need to basically array or copy and, um, and then let's, let's do it. <laughs> okay, I'll pause again. Uh, Okay, so fi finally, so this is it. So you can see all these lines. Um, basically, all match match the the this um this this shape. Okay, so let's just cl click on finish and finish again. And okay, so now we can apply materials. So you can see this, for example, this one's teal. I'll just control C. And then we just need to select all these, um, this, and uncheck this, control V, and that's it. And then all these white, uh, let's just select all these, And also these these are white as well, and then I'll check. I'll just type white, okay. And what else? Uh, the blue is correct. Um, light. So let's have a look what what this material is. Ah, uh, trying to pick that. Yeah. So Control C finish cancel and these ones okay and uncheck this box control V and gray okay so edit let's have a look control C finish cancel and select this and the good thing about this is we don't um, Previously, when we create, when we use the f that method, we need to join them. So, some uh, for example, this one and this one need to be uh, combined. So, we need to get rid of that line. So, we have to use join ge geometry. But this for this one, we just need to uh, when we create parts, we just need to make sure that's one piece. And yeah, I think that's it. So, yeah, I think this is good. This is a good method. And also a good thing about this method is if you change, um, so if change this one show original, so it's all still original, which means you can probably can edit, adjust this a little bit. So for, for example, I'll, I'll try, try, I'll see, maybe I'll just um, uh, change, I'll check that. Maybe I'll just try to change the curve, change the curve, and see what happens um, to the parts. These parts were not okay. Looks like we have some issue. <laughs> so I'll change the show parts. Oh, I ruined it. Um, yeah, it looks like it's not. Uh, maybe let's just keep that shape. Control Z, Control Z, Control Z, cancel, and then cancel this, and then change it to show parts. Okay, so looks like uh, it's not that flexible. Uh, when we change the shape, it might, you know, uh, break all these parts. So I think I'll just leave it as it is. So this is a different method, um, and. I think it's easier. It's uh, easier than 
the first one. So yeah, thanks for uh, let me know this uh, this this uh, this method. Okay, so um, yeah, I think that's it. Um, let's go back to yeah so once again so if you have any questions uh i, I haven't had time to look um to read all this but yeah anyway so if you have any questions or like ideas suggestions just put just just paste uh to the end of this this page so make sure you, uh, the end not not the the beginning because um i might miss them <laughs> if you if you post it in the front okay so um thanks thanks for watching and uh i'll see you next time